pet turtles an important cause of salmonella outbreaks? Hi, I'm Dr. James Machino. You know, there's been six major multi-state outbreaks of salmonella infection in the past five or six years. And one of the major causes is the handling of small pet turtles. The, the truth is that turtles are vectors of salmonella bacteria. That means they carry the bacteria, they can transmit the bacteria to humans, and their excrement pollutes the water in which they live with salmonella bacteria that can also become, um, you know, enter the human body quite easily if you're in contact with that water. Now, infants and small children are particularly susceptible to salmonella infection. Small turtles, they handle them like they're little pets and it looks like they're just these little benign, friendly little creatures. But they're, they're actually getting, coming in direct contact with, the cell, with large amounts of salmonella bacteria. Sometimes the, the turtles are really small, they can put them in their mouth and play with them like they're toys. And if they come into contact with the water in their environment, it just compounds the problem. And in, in uh, children and infants, only a small number of bacteria are required to start a serious salmonella infection. Whereas in adults, normally, you know, a larger concentration of bacteria is necessary to start the infection. So based on all of this, a long time ago, in 1975, the Food and Drug Administration banned turtles uh, with uh, shells less than four inches from being uh, legally for sale. Yet many outlets continue to sell these small little turtles illegally. So the best advice I can give you is, is don't have pet turtles in your house and ensure that your children are not visiting households where small turtles have been adopted as pets. Reminds me of the first Rocky movie. You know, Rocky came home to his apartment and he had those two little turtles in the aquarium. He called them Cuff and Link. I guess like Cuff Links. And so they're very cute and it looks like a fun thing to have, but you know, it's not a great idea to have them in your home for the reasons that I'm citing here. So if, click on the link below and read my short little review article on this so you'll get all the details. And if you have children, you know, it's a really important read. Now at MachinoHealth.com, you'll see a number of my research review papers, footage from my live professional seminars, other downloads and resources I've created. They're all there to help you lead a long, healthy, functional life. My research review papers and teaching materials are complete with all the scientific references, so you'll know you're getting only sound scientific information from me on any health topic that you're looking for. So you should make MachinoHealth.com an ongoing, reliable resource of health and wellness information for both you and your family. Thanks so much for watching.